ओके व्यूअर्स दिस इज स्टेप अप एंड स्टेप डाउन वोल्टेज रेगुलेटेड सर्किट यूजिंग आई आर जेड फोर फोर एन एंड आई एम डिक्रीज माई लाइट एल डी चीजिंग दिस इज ग्रोइंग डाउन एन आई पुर दिस स्विच इट इज ग्रोइंग अप फॉर द पर्पज ऑफ वोल्टेज लेवल अप फ्रॉम द आई एफ जेड फोर फोर एन दिस इज जस्ट डेमोस्ट्रेशन वीडियो द मेन वीडियो आई एम शोइंग हाउ टू मेक दिस सर्किट एज ए प्रोफेशनली any appliance and any source and also explaining how this is circuit is actually worked hello viewers this is tanpir you are see tech master bidi welcome to my channel before see this video you can subscribe if you are new in the channel you also subscribe me a like also share with your friends this is irf z44 n You know the gate value of I have that for for n. First is gate, second is drain, and third is source. That means gate, drain, source. Now I am implant this MOSFET, this breadboard. Check two push button switch. For one is voltage up and one is voltage down for this regulator circuit. This two push button switch are implanted on my breadboard. Now take two wire from the voltage source side. The red wire is voltage positive and black wire is voltage negative. Okay, my voltage source connection is done with a red board positive side and negative side. This is very low microfarad as a barrister. Using this for voltage controlling in 220 volt to 3.5 volt and else. This is 1 microfarad and 250 maximum voltage consumption. This is 3.5 mega ohm resistor. Now I'm take two wire to connect capacitor with MOSFET. Okay, these two wire from capacitor. The one is going on the MOSFET gate part, and one is going for MOSFET drain part. The capacitor connection is done. Now I need extra two wire to connect this switch to negative side of my voltage source and this switch positive side of my voltage source. Okay, this connection is done. Take okay, one connector to connect two push switch with one point. Okay, my this connection is done. Now this resistor connect with the common side of two push bottom switch and connect with the capacitors positive side which is connected with gate side of my MOSFET. Okay, now resistor is connected. Okay, this circuit is very simple for everyone. This is finished biasing. Now I am connecting with the appliance for test this circuit. This is my appliance negative side, and this is appliance positive side. Okay, my negative side of my appliance connect with MOSFET drain, and positive side of my appliance side connect with directly positive side of my voltage source. Okay, my appliance connection is done. Now connect the MOSFET source side to a negative side of my voltage source. For this purpose, take a one wire to connect negative side of my voltage source to MOSFET source side. Okay, my connection is done. Okay, I set my voltage source as a 12 volt. When I set this voltage, if I push this switch, this capacitor will be gradually charged through 3.5 mega ohm resistor. This from gradually charging, the LED is gradually upgrading level up. That means the voltage is gradually increasing. Okay, now this is negative side of my voltage source connection. That's why. If I push the switch, this capacitor gradually discharge. That means this light gradually decreasing. That means the voltage of output gradually decreasing. This is the theory for this. Now test the circuit. Okay, my power supply is turned on. Let's see what is the effect of pushing the switch. Okay, and again push the switch. Okay, this is increasing. Okay, this is maximum. Now in second part of the switch, if I push this. This is decreasing. That means voltage is gradually decreasing. Okay. Now this is turning off. If I steady step pushing the switch, the light is going increasing up. If I push the switch, it is going down. Okay. This is the step up and step down voltage regulator. If you want to establish this circuit with your any kinds of appliance, you can do. With this, okay. Let's see the effect. What is the voltage upgrading from this circuit? 
when I'm pushing the part of my voltage source okay this is increasing okay this is increasing my appliance is also 12 volt operatable LED that's why this is only glow for the 12 volt but the multimeter showing the voltage upgrading for this, from the circuit okay this is 8 volt now the LED is also glowing okay, this is 10 volt steady response okay this is the maximum this is the example and explanation how this circuit worked yours you can subscribe my channel also like and please share thank you for the watching see you in the next video